believe I could communicate it with something and or something happened that, that uh, would make me believe that something exists. Sounds. I was asking um, di direct questions and they were answering back. I can hear you. I can hear you. I can hear you. I can hear you. Within um, five minutes of being in this building, I mean, there was noise everywhere, okay? And it just seemed like anything that we asked a question to or wanted to get out of the entity around us, it would, it would provide. Quite often, EVPs. Could you please do that again? We were trying to pinpoint the location of where it was coming from and over, it couldn't have been more than 15 feet away. From where we were at, it was just, I mean, you, you could distinguish it as a human voice whistling. I mean, I'm not going to sit here and say that, you know, something is what it is when it isn't. I mean, I'll call a spade a spade, and I'll tell you what, that was a, that was a spade. That thing was not happy. We were, in, we were in one cluster like we are right now, and it would be as if, if we're looking over, over the, the balcony, it was in the over corner. to like our right, or over our shoulder, to where it was, but it wasn't, I mean, we could see where the other guys were at, the other yeah. groups at. I mean, there's no way that it could, and it's a whistle. It kind of turned into a, if, are we bothering you, and if we are bothering you, you know, let us know type of thing and then it was several clangs in a row and then uh not long after that it sounded like somebody was dead sprinting towards us very loud right there Jesse are sitting in this room right now. The room temperature just dropped to where we can see our breath. close to what I've experienced tonight. And it's just, there's been a lot of feelings and a lot of like emotions that have just come over me with really no explanation other than being here.